all right guys hope you guys are doing well um just wanted to come out here and do a quick little video for youtube um uh, got to thinking i was trying to do this video earlier my phone was giving me problems and i got to thinking about uh they say we got a go a housing uh crisis and you, know, you got all these homeless people on the streets not to say some of them don't just want to be homeless they're homeless because they want to do it or whatever and they got drug problems whatever um but you know i was thinking about this government housing stuff i lived in government housing at one time won't do it again because of the rules you know they won't let people smoke in there they won't let them own they won't let them be gun owners and i can understand some people are mentally ill they shouldn't own guns that's all good you know but if you're a law-abiding citizen you're paying your rent you shouldn't have those rules strapped on you you know you can't have a washer and a dryer in the apartment because they got washer and dryers on the facilities that you have to pay for so the government's making money off of you on top of your rent that you're paying that ain't right i mean they should loosen up on the rules you can only have one dog and you got to have it documented you got to pay for it and it's got to be a certain type of animal i'm sure or one cat you know if i'm paying rent it shouldn't really matter whether i got guns or, or what but i guess it's because it's government housing that gives them the right to do it right um another thing i mean i feel like with the housing crisis a way to fix this is to make interest rates cheaper make it easier for people to get along you know people on disability that want to own a house make it so they don't have you know five hundred dollar payments a thousand dollar payments for a house i mean of course you're not going to buy a mansion for cheap but if it's just a normal two or three bedroom house they shouldn't pay the high prices that they're paying the high notes um you know, I remember back when me and my ex-wife were doing rent to own a house. We were trying to get a mortgage on it so we would actually own it. Because if you actually own a house, there's more programs available to you that you can use for, you know, hot water tank or whatever. Free things that you qualify for if you're under a certain income. Well, we could not get that because we couldn't get a freaking mortgage loan. And they told us uh, $10,000. We had to have $10,000 to put down before they would help us with a mortgage loan and we our credit wasn't good at the time so that was out it's just a shame you know how hard it is in this country uh, we got to start fixing some of this crap you know and making it easier for people so people don't have to struggle i mean i myself i'm in a 24 foot uh, rv just because it's uh cheaper that way right now so i get money saved up and and everything turns out to be a little bit better and maybe i'll have a job in the future you know all right guys just wanted to drop a quick little video just life man that's it uh like share subscribe i appreciate all the support on the videos have a good day